Hello and welcome to Me in the USA. I am the Heathen Chips, and this is my associate, Mr. Gray. And this week's honey will come to us from Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. Pure American honey from Butcher's Behind. <laughs> yep. He said it on me. Oh. Um, yep. Put a little twang on Butcher's Behind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you didn't even meet Butch, man. Don't even. Oh, you met Butch? I met Butch. Butch. I said I would elaborate. Okay. Butch was a kind and hearty man selling honey from a box outside his home on a pull-through driveway. When I came to pay the man as he was in the garage, he said to just leave the money in the box and take the goods, making the exchange feel like a polite drug deal. If only had a gun on him, but it made it feel like home. This, uh, again, was one of the ones that I found on a road trip. Uh, I actually got to meet the proprietor and uh, got to see the hives and stuff out in the backyard. Nice little, um, nice little like, four pallets worth of, uh, worth of hives. Nice area out by the, uh, out by the bay and uh, real cozy area. Just real touristy kind of place, but um, nice. Mm -hmm. Looks kind of clear for, uh, as far as a lot of the other hunters would go. Thick. Mm-hmm. Kind of syrupy. Uh, mm -hmm. It does have a sweetness, but uh, almost like a the after flavor you might get if after when like the honey is crystallized. Yeah, yeah, not far off from. Nothing too discerning on it. I do. Mm -hmm. It's um. Kind of got a little twang towards uh, the middle of the taste to it, but mm -hmm. otherwise, you know, general honey, uh, honey consistency and flavor. Yeah, got your general sweetness you're looking for, maybe even a little bit higher than some of the other sweetnesses, but still. Mm-hmm. All right, well, let's give it a shot. Let's give it a see what goes. All right, we're back with Massachusetts and Butch's Behind Hunt. Give it a try. It's very light up front, but it hits with floral in the back. Yeah. Really strong, like more floral than Yeah, that's a back life. That That's a full back end right there. Yeah, I, my note for this one was that it was bittersweet. Yeah. Yeah, like it, the sweet, yeah, sweetness definitely hits you first, and then, and then it's uh, that like, floral, it's like yeah, that flower smack. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't necessarily dislike it though. I don't hate it, but I'm. It's it's, it's not what I would recommend either. It's almost slightly perfumey. I was thinking that, but I don't want to say the perfumey because I've had other floral alcohols that I would consider perfumey like an elderflower alcohol, mm -hmm. and those ones taste more like they're hitting you with alcohol and you're not really getting that here, but you're getting like the perfume scent and a flavor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, well, Massachusetts, impressive. Interesting. 